Good evening and welcome to the Financial Week. I'm Javon Keyes. The Jamaican dollar has hit a new record low compared to the U.S. currency for a second consecutive day. At the end of trading today, the U.S. currency is being sold for an average $157.63. The record before was $157.55, of course, set yesterday. Meanwhile, $123.74 is the going rate for the Canadian dollar, $212.73 for the pound, while the euro is costing an average $180.88. The National Commercial Bank, NCB Financial Group, earned less profit for its first quarter, which ended December 2021. The company shared its latest financial position at an annual general meeting held this morning. NCB Financial Group is reporting another quarter of reduced profit since the start of the pandemic. The entity says for the three months which ended December, net profits declined marginally. The group report record reported a net profit of $5.4 billion for the quarter, the net profit attributable to shareholders was $2.6 billion, $1.3 billion or 33% below the prior results, and $1.7 billion or 39% lower than the September quarter. NCBFG's Deputy CEO Dennis Cohen says the group's banking segment also saw reduced profit. The net results from banking and investment activities reflected a marginal decline of $483 million. This was mainly attributable to a $4.8 billion reduction in gains from securities dealings and foreign exchange transactions and also a $700 million increase in credit impairment provisions. Mr. Cohen says the decline was, however, tempered by an increase in net interest income and higher fees and commission income due to growth in their performing loans portfolio and increased transactions through its payment services business. Meanwhile, TFOB, NCB's fintech arm, says its move into digital currency solutions with the Link app has seen strong interest. CEO of TFOB, Vernon James, says the company is looking to expand the capabilities of Link. We have over 40,000 people using the app now uh, since we launched in December. We're unlock unlocking functionality as we develop. So in the immediate future, we have bill payments, we have mobile top-up. We have the ability to cash in and cash out at the ABMs of NCB. So anybody can go in, uh, open a link account, and add money to your link account through your ABM. Link is NCB's thrust into digital cash as the company prepares for the official rollout of the central bank digital currency CBDC. NCB was the lead commercial bank which participated in the CBDC pilot. That ended in December 2021. Let's head to the stock market. The JSE index gained 2,102 points today, while the Juno market index gained 11 points. Among today's winners were Margaritaville Turks, SSL Venture Capital Jamaica, Cygnus Real Estate Financial, Medical Disposals and Supplies Limited, and PBS US Dollar Shares, while on the losing side were JMB Group 7.25% shares, Portland JSX, Mayberry Investments, Everything Fresh and Access Financial Services. And that's it for the Financial Week. I'm Javon Keyes. Before we go, here's a preview of what to expect in the Business View this Sunday.